Hi, Mike Pub, and this is Bratz from 2010 that I will be adding to my wish list. There were 24 dolls. This is the start of the second era of Bratz. So this goes from 2010 to 2014, and we left off in the last video in 2009, which is always weird that they're like, oh, this is a reboot, but I guess it's like they're kind of reimagined. I just feel like there wasn't like a huge gap nor was there in my opinion the biggest switch up other than maybe a little bit more modern fashion I actually like look at some of these and think of some of like the earlier the yeah earlier moxie girls like have a huge comparison so I don't know but that's just my thoughts um so let's get in we have uh, Adri Audrey I don't know how to say her name. She's really pretty. I love her um, her little jacket piece. I think that's really cute. I've seen it somewhere. I've seen... <sighs> I've seen something about it. It's cute. I really like it. I really like this character. I think she's new. Um, her leggings and shorts are also really cute. I talk about that. I love leggings and shorts look. I used to wear it all the time in school. We have Ashby. Is that her name? Um, she's also really cute. It seems like maybe these are new, like, characters. I'm not sure. Uh, what's this? It just says 10th anniversary. Okay. Um, she's really cute. I love her little sneaker heels. Those are super fun. I feel like a lot of people don't love that, but I think it's cute. She has a little sweater crop sweater vest thingy i like sweater vests on dolls and i like the shirt that's the striped shirt underneath it i think that's really cute the skirt is cute as well um then we have cameron and i'm not the biggest fan of this doll because i think he's supposed to be wearing jeans and because like listen i like skinny jeans but this looks like he's wearing leggings like i didn't see enough of like the jean look and I just don't love how it was executed. I do, however, like his shirt and the tie. I think that's really cute. I also like his face. Um, we have Carrie. Carrie's really cute. She's the last one in the lineup. Uh, or at least this row. Um, I really like her. I think she's super cute. I like the... We're going to call them overalls. Is it maybe... Maybe it's just like a lower part and then there's a vest. I can't tell. I don't know. I think this is really cute. You can also get that short and legging look there as well. Um, a lot going on here. I like her little sneaker high top. No, what is that? Wedges, I think, maybe. She's super cute. Um, and I like that they're like, you know, doing something new. Next, we have Chloe. Um, she's super cute in this dress with the shirt underneath. I feel like that's a really big style of like I was gonna say like 2010 but I feel like even before but maybe I'm wrong because Hannah Montana came out early 2000s right maybe late 2000s I don't know I don't remember I feel like she used to wear that a lot but maybe I'm just making that up maybe that was Alex Russo I don't know um anyways I like the little um leg warmers as well I love that look covering the heels I think those are super cute um I don't know for whatever reason she's not giving Chloe like if you were to be like oh her name's this uh, anything other than Chloe I would believe you because she's not giving Chloe that much but she's still really cute then we have Dylan I do actually really like this one he is very simple here but I think that that's why I like it I like the little bracelets I like the little I guess they're cuffs maybe I don't I like the flannel shirt, um, and then I like the pants. I mean, they're simple, but it's a cute look. Then we have Jade, and she looks to be wearing, like, a cropped jacket and some type of, we're gonna call it thicker, thicker shirt. I was gonna call it, like, a sweater, but I don't think it's a sweater or sweatshirt, um, but it does have, like, the front pockets. Maybe it's supposed to be a sweatshirt. I don't know. She's got cute pants on, and again, those wedge heels. It looks like Maybe it is. Is it just heels? Um, they're cute. I like the look and I'm glad that they keep doing it. And then lastly, we have something in the way. Is it going to be like Jolie? I don't know what this name is. Um, she's cute. I like yellow and red together. I think yellow and red look really cute. I like the little puffer jacket and it's cropped, the little yellow t-shirt. The skirt is super cute because there's like colors in it. And then those like knee high socks. I really want knee high socks. I think they look cute. Um, next we have what, okay, still the same line, uh, Leora, Leora, I don't know how to say her name, she's cute, I like the, um, shirt, I was just talking about how, like, they don't do a lot of, like, graphic shirts on dolls, 
and I wish that they did and this is really cute because that you can like make graphics that aren't based off of like you go into Target and go into like the Wild Fable graphics section like obviously those are bands you're gonna have to pay money for them but this is like simple it's cute and it's like not you know not referencing anything you know what I mean um but I really like that I also like the little jacket the pattern and then the knee-high socks because I like knee-high socks leg warmers I think they look really cute especially on dolls and I feel like people don't do it enough so yeah Liliana also by the way no clue if we've already seen any of these characters just gonna let you know it's not a main character and I can tell you that um other than Chloe J Dylan and maybe the other boy I don't remember what his name was um She's cute. I like the, I'm going to assume it's like a jacket under, or not a jacket, um, like a dress type of vibe and then a long sleeve shirt. It's like a thicker long sleeve shirt um, and it's textured, which I think is really cute. It's not super basic. I don't know. It just adds to it. I really like the layering that they're doing here again with the knee high socks. I assume they're not actually socks because they don't have like feet, you know what I mean? But cute I really like this I like long sleeve shirts as well this one I'm not the biggest fan of this is Lydia I don't know the purple and the puffy part on her shirt is not my most favorite in the world and I don't like the pants they kind of are giving like sweatpants vibes and I don't know why because I don't I feel like they're just leggings but they're giving more poofy her shoes are cute and I really like her face but I didn't like the look I'm sorry Okay, Sasha. Sasha looks cute here. I like the blue and black. I feel like I've seen this on something. And then the white pants are giving like Hannah Montana with the blue and black top. And then she's wearing a, I'm going to call it a long sleeve shirt, but it kind of looks like it could be a bodysuit, but I'm sure that they didn't put a bodysuit on a doll in 2010. Um, but it's like glittery and that looks really cute. And I like her shoes as well. Her hair is also super cute. They gave her, um, some sh- white stripes uh next Lou, okay who are you Sh shoddy shady I don't, know. I don't know this one's name i'm sorry i like her mm, okay i'm debating i kind of like the puffy pants i would need to see a better stock image for this but i kind of like the puffy pants um puffy shorts they don't go all the way down and that kind of bothers me but that's okay her upper like upper body is definitely really cute I really like that I like her shoes I like her little vest and little bandana around her neck her face her hair is really cute it's giving um it reminds me of because this one came first the glow up girl doll that I really like I have her um just like the hair you know like the stripe I, any time a doll that has darker hair has, like, a lighter stripe, um, even if it's not the same color, I'm going to compare them, but this one looks so good. She's so pretty. Definitely want this doll. Don't really recognize her, so I assume probably harder to get. Shira, we're just making up names now, um, because I don't know how to pronounce these. Um, uh, Anyways, um, I like her pants. I do like these ones' pants. They're puffy. They are, like, not super tight. You can see the stitching details on them. I like the purple jacket. You can't really see her top, but that's okay. Her face is quite cute, and she has volume in her hair. Very pretty. Tyla. I almost said Twyla. We're going to be honest there. Um... I like her little, I'm going to call it a romper. I assume that's what she's wearing. I like the pattern. Um, I think it's cute. She's wearing leggings, which again, love leggings and short look. I think that's cute. Um, also, there's like bows on the little romper, which is cute. And then she's a really fun jacket. I can't remember what this texture is called. It looks like um, sometimes jeans are made out of it. I don't know what it's called. Um, but I love that texture. I bought a pair of jeans just for that, and that's what that reminds me of. I don't remember what it's called, though. Ugh, I didn't mean to go back to you. Anyways, um, light pants. I like the little leggings. They're, like, almost see-through, so you can't see them very much, but they're fluffy. Next, we have Yasmin. 
Yasmin's quite cute here. I like her little jacket piece. Again, like one thing that I'm noticing with at least the 2010s right now, they're very like layered outfits. And I think that that's really cute. I like the layeredness of them. They definitely added a lot to them. I wonder if they come with second outfits because brats always or a lot of the brats did. But anyways, I like her jacket. There's like gold detail to kind of match her gold earrings. She has a really cute flowy shirt underneath. It's kind of giving like nightgown, but it doesn't go long enough to be giving nightgown. She's got those little cute shorts on and then gray leggings and then heels. Really, really like this look. Yasmin's last in the line. Go all the way over. Go down. Okay, don't see anything else. Then there's fashion packs. I don't really show the fashion packs, but here you can like gloss over them. Uh, a cruiser fourth edition and then let's talk I assume that these dolls talk which is why they're called that um so we have Chloe she's really cute I love bucket hats they're growing on me also she's wearing the same outfit as the other one let's go look I think she's on the side yeah look at that she's practically wearing she's got the same shirt it looks like pants and that jacket Chloe okay it looks like maybe not the same shoes, but definitely the same, practically the same outfit. I would definitely only get one of them, and I want to say that I would get this one because we don't see her a lot or see her much, but I really like Chloe's outfit there. She even is wearing the same shoes. Disappointing. Um, she does have more art articulation, it kind of looks like, um, but I really like her bucket hat. Um, I would have to, if I ever got her, I think I would have to put her in a different outfit disappointing next uh and then it looks like we've got yasmin from ah uh, is she she's wearing the same outfit as one of these ones oops i keep doing that it's because i went to click on oh who is it whose outfit are you wearing you're wearing this one's outfit liliana so i wouldn't get these dolls they're cute because they have more articulation it would really just be whoever i found first i yeah I do like their hats, though. I really like their hats that they come with. Then we have Party 2nd Edition Chloe. She looks so cute. I love her dress, the red detailed, like, top part, and then the poofy skirt. I think that that's so pretty. And then I love the shirt underneath. Again, you're seeing a lot of layering. It looks like she's wearing leggings and some sort of leg warmers that go over the heels. Super cute. Love her jean jacket as well. I really like this era because you got to see a lot of, um, like, layering and stuff. And it also, I don't know, it'll get into, like, shake it up chicago what's that called is it shake it up see, see i was gonna sing the intro um shake it up which i feel like they wore a lot of very fun outfits and that's what i remember watching anytime i hear people talk about like 2010 2015 i guess before that whatever shake it up came out like that's always what i think about um is that show anyways um sorry off track jay's wearing a cute shirt underneath that has some like pattern details cute i like the little tutu piece i love tutus and i love that we're seeing many of them here um it's red and pink i can't help it she's got some sort of like leggings on and a jacket she's really cute here and then we have sasha uh she's also super cute there she's wearing the half um I wouldn't call it a bust, but I don't think that's what that's called. What is that? Um, it's half. Like, it doesn't go up her body, just to her stomach. It's white and gold. It's cute. I like the shirt, the gray shirt underneath. They're using, like, that material, and I love that so much. And then she's wearing gold leggings. Cute, fluffy jacket. She looks adorable here. Is there anyone else? Yes. Yasmin is also a part of this line. She also looks to be wearing those gold leggings, some jeans, a purple, like, see-through mesh jacket. Super cute. I love her um, shirt underneath. It also looks like they have articulation. So, that's me. I do think that that's correct, right? They have more articulation. Uh, and then you're going to see a photo of them. Anyone else? There's a little play set that goes with it. Sorry. Uh, and then we have the Style Salon and Spa, 3rd edition, cute, I feel like we've seen that, and then we have the Twins, Phoebe is super cute, is it the same, tw oh my gosh, if I keep doing that, I'm gonna cry, Phoebe and Roxy, okay, yeah, so we've already seen these twins before, but they're doing them again, they're cute, I love her little zebra print outfit with colors in it, the purple and pink, I think that's really cute, I love her pink 
out like top the jacket is super cute and it matches the heels and then she has on black leggings i love this dress it's i keep calling it flannel but that's not the correct term right i don't know what the pattern is called and then the black and white that one looks more flannel what is her top what's the dress called i can't think of it um i'm sorry <laughs> And then it kind of looks like maybe they're wearing the same leggings. It's okay. They're twins. They probably have the same outfits. Anyways, they both look really cute here. Um, anyone else? Nope. That is the end of 2010. Uh, brats that I'll be adding to my wish list. Eventually, you'll get to see all of the dolls on the wish list. But anyways, I'm Actipad. Thanks for watching. And I hope you enjoyed. Let me know your thoughts on the videos. But yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye.